Hello everybody, welcome back. So, first shake today and it is currently quarter to four. I haven't been hungry, but I did drop the girls off this morning. I was so exhausted. I came home, sat here and I fell asleep. And I didn't wake up until about half past one. And then we've been outside doing some bits on the bike. So, I just haven't had a shake. This is the first time I've had a chance to make my shake. So, I've made a latte one, a big giant latte one. It's so yummy. It's my favourite shake. I love this shake. Out of all the flavours, latte has got to be my absolute favourite. So, um, yeah, it just tastes so milky, even though there's no milk in it. It just tastes so creamy and yummy and mm, delicious. Say hello. Why? Why? I said hi. Oh, I thought you said why. I was going to be like, what do you mean why? You could have just said hello. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Oh god, I'm tired, I need to wash my hair because tomorrow is weigh day. And we're thinking about going up to see my consultant on the bikes and then taking them to get washed afterwards. Although it's gonna rain the rest of the week, so it seems a bit pointless. But yeah. Um so first shake, um I've still got three more to have. Don't think I'm gonna get three more shakes in today somehow. I'm gonna have this one now, have another one of maybe six maybe eight and ten so like every two hours maybe i don't know but i'll probably have to set a reminder for that because i don't remember and i'm in the, currently cooking dinner for the kids they're all having and cane um they're all having roast pork today so yeah i'm um still not sure if i'm gonna come off plan tomorrow because if Kane comes with me to see my consultant, it's our wedding anniversary tomorrow, so we're thinking about going out for lunch or something, doing something nice, because we can't really celebrate tomorrow, because uh, we've got a lot on. And then we're going to think about going out Monday instead. So I might come off plan tomorrow just to go out for lunch with him. And then uh, he's getting quite grumpy with me lately. He's like whenever i say i don't feel well or something even though it's totally undiet related he's he straight away it's this diet is he hates this diet because i don't want to do anything or go anywhere when i'm doing this diet just because everything involves food like we always go out in the daytime normally and we always go out and have lunch somewhere and go out riding around on our bikes or whatever and it's just our downtime but because I can't eat we don't do that and he won't eat if i'm not eating like last few days he hasn't eaten he's like well, you're not eating, so I won't eat. And I'm like, but I am eating. I'm eating my diet product. He's like, yeah, but you're not sitting down and eating with me. So, yeah. So, we might have lunch out tomorrow. I'm not sure. Hannah still wants to do another week of shakes. So, I might do that with her. Um, and then just come off plan tomorrow for lunch with Kane. And then again on Monday. And then be straight back on the shakes again. But yeah. It all depends on tomorrow whether I've lost weight or whether I've maintained or whatever because I've solely had shakes all week, nothing else. And if I haven't lost any weight, then I don't see the point anymore because I just feel like it's been weeks now where I haven't had a good loss. So, and I know I've only got a tiny bit left to lose, but I feel like how many weeks are going to go on maintaining and me never get into that go away am i being unrealistic wanting to be eight and a half stone i don't know anyway i'm gonna drink my shake um i'm not hungry though um uh, i've had about a liter of water um and i'm just making my way through a second bottle of these but i also had so i've had one and a half of these so far and now this one doesn't help that I was asleep all morning otherwise I probably would have drank a lot more right speak to you later hello so currently about five to seven chocolate shake time hmm yummy 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 um I was supposed to have this a lot earlier but I just didn't have time I was sorting out the kids dinner sat down and before i knew it it's seven o'clock i don't understand where the time has gone today to be honest with you so second shake is going to be chocolate 
So, yeah. Mm, I'm kind of looking forward to and not looking forward to tomorrow for weigh-in. Um, I don't feel like I've lost anything, so I'm kind of dreading it, to be honest. Um, I think about going to get my nose pierced tomorrow. Kane keeps saying to me, why didn't you get your nose pierced? Why didn't you get your nose pierced? I was like, I don't know. And then my friend's going, do it, do it, do it, Hannah. So I really want this pierced, though. I'd love a little ring here. Or whichever side it is, I don't know. Hmm, I'm a bit of a chicken shit, though. So I don't know. We went past the place yesterday and Kim was like, come on then, come on, come on. I'll hold your hand, don't worry. And I was like, no, they don't do it, thank God. Let's get on the bike and go. So, yeah, I really want my tongue pierced again. I don't know why I'm telling you all this. Um... But I'm, I'm a wuss. And when you bite your tongue, it bloody hurts. So I'm like, mm, can they numb it? And they're like, no, we don't do that here. I'm like, oh, maybe not then. So yeah, I'm not sure. But I do miss my tongue bath. Anyway, oh, I'm knackered. Second shake. Speak to you all later. Okay, so it is half past nine. This is just going to be shake, 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 shake today. That's it. Because... I'm not doing anything while well, I'm going to work in a bit. Another latte because this is my favourite, favourite, favourite. This one's so nice and creamy. I actually put two spoons of mixer mousse in this one um, and it's made it even more. It's just really nice. It's really thick and creamy and just, I can't even describe it. It's just so yummy. I like cream. It's like drinking double cream. But coffee flavour. Mm, so yummy. I could drink that all day long. I think tomorrow I might just get all vanilla shakes and just live off these. I think that's going to be my plan. We shall see. Um, so... I'm going to work soon, 10 o'clock. What I might do is I've got that one latte left in the fridge that I swapped when I was with Hannah the other day, Sunday. So I might take that out with me and then uh, when we're out and about, I can always run into McDonald's and just ask them for a cup of ice like I did at KFC the other day and then pour it into that and drink it in the car if I need it. Um, it might be worthwhile me getting a couple actually for next week while I'm out and about because that was a lifesaver actually. I thought that worked really well for me. My dad rang me earlier on, right? And he, as soon as I answered, he always FaceTimes me or WhatsApp calls me. Anyway, I was sat here on this chair that I'm on now like this and he rang me and I think my top was like this and he went, oh my God, what's happened to you? You're sick. I was like, there's something wrong with me. He was like, look at those bones. You look like a skeleton. I think all my weight is coming off in the wrong places. I don't want to lose weight here. I want to lose it off my legs. So I get what he is saying, like here. When I was sat earlier, I could quite easily get my hand underneath my strap without it touching it. So my bones are definitely starting to stick out quite a lot up here. And I don't want to lose weight from here. I want to lose the weight from here, like this. So I was like, something wrong with me. He says, I'm going to bring loads of wine to your house so you can have drink wine every night. And then Emily turned around and said, she was watching telly as well. Like we kept saying, Emily, come and say hello to grandpa. Emily totally blanked us. As soon as dad said that he was going to bring wine around for me to drink every night. Emily was like, no, mummy's not allowed it. She's on a diet. I was like, oh, you heard that okay, but you just didn't want to come and say hello. It's amazing what kids hear when you think they're not listening. But yeah, so uh, I don't know where I'm going with this. But anyway, I might just get all vanilla shakes next week and a couple of ready-mades to take out with me because that was so much easier than trying to make anything else and take it with me. I'm going to try and drink this quickly because I've got, about half an hour Kane's gonna come home eat his dinner his roast and um and then we're gonna go to work i hate these nails i love the color but they're just too short they feel really horrible my fingertips are all sore because i'm not used to having my fingertips touching things at the top if that makes any sense i'm used to having really long nails 
and them being in the way. <coughs> I booked it as well. Tomorrow, I get my nose pierced. What side do you get pierced? The left. I have this side pierced, so the left hand side. Does it mean something different if you get a different size pierced or not? Yeah. It does. Yeah, like, if you wanted your right, you can go right. Yeah, I can just see the piercing when I bought this. Yeah, I reckon that'll bug me. I'll keep thinking I've got something on my nose and be like, get off, get off, and then I'll be like, ow, 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 all the time. Oh, I wish I could turn the camera around now. Tyler sat there looking at her piercing like. Actually, quite terrifying. I see it. <laughs> pulling funny faces. So anyway, yeah, it's booked. I'm trying to convince Kane to get his eyebrow pierced because I think it looked really good on him, but he won't do it. He's a wuss. But I think it's really nice when men have it pierced here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, like, oh, I think it's does. really hot, but he won't do it. He said they'd have to numb it first. I could always smack him in the face and then say, get it done. <laughs> that might work, mightn't it? So, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to drink my shake. I won't come on again because... I very much doubt I'll come on again because I probably won't have another shake. I'll be too... I'm not hungry at all. That's the only thing about... The only thing I like about doing the shake challenge is that I don't get hungry on it. Very occasionally I'll wake up really hungry or I'll get hungry. But most of the time I'm not hungry. So it's really good. They fill me up. But um, it's just that it's so restrictive because you have to be at home to make the shakes. And the ready-mades always give me belly ache. So we'll see. So this could be see you tomorrow for weigh-in. Or I might see you later. I don't know yet. Either way, I'm out. Bye.